Okay. Uh, uh. up on the spin yeah as you can hear they might be sealed on it's gonna show it's also hooked up now loads of jellyfish in the water and shit very aggressive What's up to the camera, Lee? I'm gonna put that on. You need a hand. You want a hand? Not in a hurry. I'm far off anyway. Yo, what's up, Argus? Cool. So, I'm gonna show you the easiest way to clean Katunko or different ways how to. Um, so, basically, this way that I've done, it's one way how we get guts out quite easy. Lift up the siphon or pick fin, whatever it is. Find the bone that's usually here on the side. Yellow tail's always got a bone here. Katunko, yeah, not so much. Cool, you cut all that up into the head. There, yeah, because the fillet goes all the way to here, soft and juicy. Cut through, make sure you cut to the bone. Then you can turn. Where those little fins are, get the knife, get gently just under the skin, just there. That's it. Make sure it cut through the bone. Same thing on this side, lift the fin, cut into the head, all the way up, turn the knife the other way, follow that little cut that you've made, get the knife back in there, go there, go up, you don't want to waste too much, and there we go, just make sure this cut matches up with the other one on the other side, there you go, that's it, goes through, sorted, now here comes the magic, should all be loose, cool, once there, so you make sure the skin there as well, this is a cut. There we go. Now what you can do is you can pull the head up, break the neck, turn, and all the guts come out. All the guts come out. Might be a few stuck inside, but we'll show you now how to clean it even better. Cut from here, there, turn it around, push in on the tailbone or you can just go lightly sometimes katongo's got tough skin just go lightly just like that you cut the skin not too far in let's see just like that now you'll see you can almost lift up the skin you can't take this off though unfortunately you find the tail you go through you find the backbone go through go i'm cutting through the side fins here take a look Sometimes I just push down on the fish, just like that. And then we cut it like that. You should be cutting the side ribs. It's there. And now you lift it as you cut. So you're cutting against these side pieces here. There we go. If you are lazy, you can just cut right through it. But yeah, I'd rather just get your knife at the right angle. And I'll show you now. One thing here, you got your belly pieces here, this side yeah, good for smoking, this is good for sashimi, but we'll get through that now. So now you've got your two fillers that you've made, you can see the bloodline running through there. What you do is you take a knife and you cut through like that, like a V, and you cut just a little piece of the end and you basically pull the whole thing off. One thing, doing it this way. You end up with a whole belly piece like this with the gut cavity inside, right? 
That's fine, but this is good eating. So what we do, I'll just cut through all these ribs. Show you the wine now in a second. Cut up to the ball. Or some chum. Cool, and then we get rid of the rest of the guts. Okay, how's the buckets? So we got our katronko today. We're just gonna spice it with the uh, four little ingredients. Um, firstly with katronko, smoked uh, paprika, flippin' nice. Salt. Black pepper. And then any other spices that you got, I just thought throw the liquor, multi-purpose flippin' liquor rice spice. Just gives it a good zang. And you can add a bit of lemon juice. We're gonna bry it flesh first, and then we can turn it over and do the skin, but throw butter over the top. These fatty pieces, you don't really have to put any spices on, because it is actually naturally sweet, being so fat. Then you pour your sauce once you turn it over. Lovely, yeah. Almost cooked. Another 10 minutes. And add a little bit of Tabasco if you want. Just a few drops. Alright, bottoms up, buckets. <laughs> a little bit lower there. Turn, it, turn the light on the side. That one side. Here we go. Do this one. I'm going to take a video. Johnny, say. Throw it. Then I lower it. Catch the fish. Clean it. Cook it. Eat it. And then I'm going to take it just now. I'm going to get GoPro for this. i put the GoPro right around my bum. Ah. <sighs> And that's a wrap, but... <laughs> Come on! And I was a good idea! And that's a wrap, folks! <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. 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 Oh.